With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hi everyone, let's take a question here. The question is give the equations for the action of sulfuric acid on potassium, hydrogen, carbonate, and sulfur. Okay. So we will discuss it one by one. So first we have potassium hydrogen carbonate that is KHCO3, right? And sulfuric acid that is H2SO4. Here we will take it in the dilute form. So it will lead to the formation of potassium sulfate that is K2SO4 plus water plus CO2. Okay. So, if we balance this reaction here, it will be 2, here also 2 and here it will be also 2. Because here we have 2 potassium, so 2. Okay, so here we have the formation of potassium sulfate. And this is the required reaction for the first part. Okay, that is A part. Now, if we discuss the B part, that is the action of sulfuric acid on sulfur, that is sulfur plus H2SO4. Here it will be in the concentrated. Okay, and it will lead to the formation of SO2 plus H2O. Okay, so here what happens is this X, S is in the plus 0, it is 0 oxidation state. Here it is in the plus 6, here it is in the plus 4. So here what happens is H2SO4 behaves as an oxidizing agent oxidizing agent it means that it is getting reduced to so2 so here it is plus 6 how h2so4 we know for hydrogen plus 1 so 2 let for sulfur be x here it will be minus 8 because for oxygen we have minus 2 so here x is equal to plus 6 so now if we calculate for so2 so let it be for x x for sulfur o minus 4 is equal to 0 x is equal to plus 4 okay so if we balance this reaction now so here it will be 2 here it will be 3 and here it will be again 2 okay so this is the required reaction for the second part okay so this is our answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today